Hello guys, welcome back and today we are going to be doing a thing that's a little bit different. Today I'm going to be doing a dragon body tutorial or at least how I draw them. I'm no professional but I had fun drawing these and I hope it helps with face sketches because that's what these are. And let's get into the video but first I want to say this is my first voiceover so yeah, I'm no, I, first voiceover, I'm no expert at voiceovers yet. Still got a lot to learn about making videos new to YouTube, but let's get into it. So the first dragon I drew, you saw that, simple dragon sitting down, wings folded up, and this is just a dragon standing up with a tail swooping over its legs, which hides the feet because that's, there's a one heck of a heck right there. Uh... Not a fan of drawing feet, but if I get them to look decent, then my drawings always come out pretty cool. So, done with that, let's get into a dragon who is full of surprise. This dragon is like, no way, type of look, you know? His wings are spread out, he's got his feet spread out, you know, he's looking surprised, his neck is stretched out. And his tail is going to be up in the air, so that just shows even more elements of surprise. Because with all my drawings, I like to put lots of feeling and emotion in them. So, that one's done. And now we're going to draw white out, or I'm going to draw white out because I'm the one drawing here. This is white out crying. I know it's, it's kind of sad, but I really do like this drawing. She's got her hands covering her eyes, and her wings are just drooping on the ground hopelessly. I feel really sorry for Whiteout because she's different from all the other dragons. She has a messed up family. You know, poor Whiteout. But I really do like Whiteout so much. Sweet little Whiteout. And this stance is even sweeter. <laughs> it's just really cool looking and cute. And I really like it. So on to the next one. It will be a dragon sitting down, or more of laying down. I don't draw many dragons like this, which is why I deeply love this one, especially since its hands are folded over its chest. It's just got its wings folded up. It's a nice, chill dragon looking out towards something. I don't know, maybe sleeping. I don't think dragons sleep like this, though. <laughs> nah. Not in the books I've read, I don't think. Maybe it's just chilling. But pretty nice dragon stance. I really, 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 really like this one because, like I said, I don't draw many dragons like that. And this this one I actually got bored of. I wasn't a huge fan of the stance. So I just got rid of it because I got bored of that idea. And replace the idea with a dragon facing the camera. Maybe I was just trying to avoid a dragon facing the camera because these are hard. But I tried to include as many variety of stances in this tutorial as possible. I'm no expert at dragon stances and this is my first tutorial and all that. But I really think this might help y'all. Um, like I said, these are hard. Dragon facing the camera. And, but I really ended up liking this, and I think we all need to practice this dragon stance, but, so yeah, I think this came out super ultra duper cute. Wow, <laughs> what kind of word is that? Super ultra duper. Uh, <laughs> but, yeah, but now this is a stance that I really like. I made it up myself. I think I did, unless someone thought of it before me, but... This dragon has one wing folded up. The other's going to be spread out behind him. I draw a lot of dragons like these off camera. His front talons are hidden behind his tail, and so are his back talons. But his front legs are, you can actually see them. I don't know. I just draw a lot of dragons like this. Now you really, really, really like it, or super ultra duper like it. <laughs> but, um... That's going to be all the dragon stances I'm going to draw, but I'm going to draw a reference before the video is over because just to show you, you color over all that blob 
and then you erase the blob afterward on the next on your first frame and well I don't know uh, I felt like drawing clear sights she's thinking really hard I guess uh, no I know she's thinking very hard look at that who could say that she's not thinking hard well she always thinks hard when does she not but so her wings are folded up I feel like at the start of the video you didn't get a super duper ultra good look at it so here you get plenty of look at this stance. Uh, yeah, I really like how the chest is poking out in front of the front legs. That's cute and just some quick coloring, no shading, just to give you an example. And yeah, those are all the dragons I'm gonna draw today, yippee. I hope you guys like this video. Like, comment, subscribe, and share, and I will see you next time, bye.